Hello everyone, Magnus here. I'm going to do an unboxing video today. Now I don't normally do this, in fact I very ever rarely do this, but this has been something I've been wanting to do for a very long time. I've been getting into filmmaking and acting and directing and it's been a lot of fun. So I've been saving up and working hard, that's why you haven't been seeing a lot of videos from me, to finally get the camera, the Sony FX30. I saved up every penny I could afford and my loving partner Faye put some money aside to get me the lens so at least I could do some filmmaking in the interim until I can afford some more expensive lenses. So without further ado, Let's open up this one first, shall we? Now these haven't been opened. First to opening. Nicely bubble wrapped. Careful because it's a lens. Ooh. It's a Sony. It's pretty cool. So, if you're not sure, the Sony FX30 is an E-mount lens. And it actually even says it on there. I don't know if you can see that. What else do they give you? Ah! That's kind of cool. You can get this uh, cool little um, flange or ring. I'm assuming this is for lighting or to maybe cut back some of the glare. That's cool. I like that. And I'm assuming it would just sit on top of that somehow. I'm not sure how, but that's pretty cool. Oh yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ah. Yeah. So it sits on there. Ah, oh, and it clicks in. Ah, oh, cool. So you can actually take that off. That's pretty cool. I'm going to pop that aside safely so it doesn't get damaged. And I think it comes with some paperwork, which is interesting to see these days. Most things don't even come with a manual. I mean, not to subtract from the video, I recently bought Mario and Luigi Brothership. And this is how sad games have gotten these days. Not even a manual. Not even a manual at all. Look at that, it's just empty. I mean, yeah, you get the game map, but that's it. What happened to the days when you used to get a manual that told you a little bit about the game, some of the characters? I miss those days. Honestly, I do. But, drum roll, please. Okay, so I'm going to bring that up. I've just opened that up off camera. I apologize tax invoice because we're in Australia I don't know they probably have tax invoices in America too you got all your paperwork there nice you got a decent length USB-C to USB-A cable that's pretty nice I've got lots of those but that's okay it's always good to have more I'm gonna pop these aside with the probably put that with the tax Invoice. Oh, it's multiple layers to this. I'm just going to have to bring it down to see the next layer. So when you get all the cable out, you're met with more little chambers. So they're really interestingly packed. So what's this? Oh, okay. That's the camera itself. And then you've got the power cord. So that side's the power cord. Whoops. That side's the power cord. And uh, looking at it, it's just your standard, what they call a figure eight power cord. Which, don't know if I'll need that, but I'll take it out just in case. And I'll leave the other one in there. Alright, I'm going to be very careful with this. Oh, it's actually it's decent weight. Nicely packed. Oh, 
There it is. Now, I am using a webcam, so this doesn't look that great. I probably could have used my GoPro. But there it is. Quite beautiful. So this folds out. And you can reverse it. Can it be reversed? Yeah, yeah, it can. It's interesting though, when you buy it, or when I'm you know, taking it out of the box, that's actually facing outwards. I would have thought that they would have actually had that facing in like that towards the body. But no matter. It feels really nice, like it doesn't feel loose. A nice, nice heft to this. It's not too heavy. Like, if you're holding this up all day long, it's not going to get too heavy in your hands, which is nice. I'm going to pop that aside and see what else we've got in the box. Because there's another box behind the box. Or rather, there's some boxes underneath. Let's see? Aha! And two batteries. So, cords, camera, two batteries. So there you have it, folks. Nice little quick unboxing video of the camera. I'm going to put all the paperwork and stuff away and uh, next you'll be able to see the video quality of it all put together. Actually, give me about two seconds and I'm going to show you what it looks like all put together. I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the camera again. I'm not taking the lens cap off. I haven't turned this on. Fully assembled. I'm actually going to reverse this now and put it back to have the screen facing inwards. So there we go again. Come on camera, be nice to me. There we go. This is my webcam. I don't know why it's being silly, but you got some nice buttons here. Screen there. Camera like that. It's actually quite decent weight. Like it wouldn't, um, it's not going to fly off on you. You've got your battery compartment there. You've got HDMI there. And looks like you've got some other ones here. Ah, okay, yep, interesting. So you got USB-C there. And what's that top one? Oh no, you got got... Um, that's not USB-C. I'm not sure what that is. But then you've got headphones and microphone there. Which is cool. And then you've got... So you've got your SD cards there. And compact flash. So you've got the CFS Express A. Uh, CFS Express A. So you've got two CFS... CF Express cards. Or SD card slots. Which is pretty cool which gives you more than enough storage. I'm assuming you can record on both. Um, so I may need to get a CF card for this before I can use it. Pretty well built camera. I can't wait to try this. And uh, I'll let you know how it goes when I actually do. So that's my unboxing video and I hope you're all doing well out there. And as always, stay awesome, stay safe and Till next time, stay splash-tastic. Later all!